first I felt um, like I needed to have an individual relationship and it did feel overwhelming because you can't. And there are people posting on the forums actually directly to me, you know, Professor Comer, can you answer my question? And, you know, hundreds, thousands, like, no, I can't, I can't answer that question, right? I'm not even going to see the question probably. Um, and so that felt disorienting and um, unfortunate, right? I felt, I felt kind of like I was not fulfilling an obligation or a, even like a, something I like doing, right? I like being a mentor to people. I like working with people. I like asking and answering questions. And so, yeah, that was overwhelming. The uh, level of, of um, talk on the forums was really overwhelming. I never knew how to, I think I wrote about this in that collection, you know, I never knew. I'm a little reserved anyways, and I really, I don't even do like Facebook. I don't do any of that. So I don't even converse online. So I don't, it was hard for me to figure out a way into the forums and, and to, to have conversations or to interact in that way. That's why I really liked the Google Hangouts because it was, you know, it was me and six, sometimes it was three students one time, one time there was, a, you know, the one student between a, a undergraduate writing tutor at Duke and then a learner in the course, and then sometimes it was me and six other students, but it was like a finite number, you know what I mean, and I made eye contact mm -hmm. with people, and it was more what I'm familiar with, but when it got to the massiveness of it, I, I don't know that I ever became comfortable with it.